This is one of the most exciting moments when finally these two amazing works are arriving from the collection of Marcel Briand, which haven't been seen in public for over 20 years. This is a monumental abstract painting by Willem de Kooning and it is just extraordinary seeing this for the first time. You really get a sense of space and light and the expansiveness of the East Hampton landscapes and monumental. It's just lyrical abstraction at its very, very best. And just the punchiness of the colours. I was not prepared for that because you cannot capture the essence of this pigment in photography or in digital images. What you can see is all the layering and experimentation of 25 years of painting at a really pivotal moment for Richter, isn't it? Because it's 1983 and here he is embarking on his first real full-scale colour, chromatic, harmonious, abstract paintings. Yeah, this is just beautiful. Here we are with a very, very cool homage with Grayson Perry's extraordinary double portrait of Gilbert and George from 1993, playing with ideas of cultural appropriation, globalization, gender identity, sexual politics, all translated with Grayson Perry's typical provocation and sense of humor. So I'm looking at Claire Tabaret's La Tente, a gorgeous exercise in layering of paint that has this kind of wonderful, washy, sepia tonality to the painting surface. Wow! Shara Hughes is extraordinary imaginary landscape painting. It's a kaleidoscope of colours with these passages of impasto here, rapid brush strokes and curling forms up here. And this all gives way to these beautiful daubs of paint that are almost like a sort of contemporary take on pointillism. Mm -hmm. 